Hi there, I'm Allie Elliott. Hi guys, I'm Allie Elliott. I'm back today um, to, you know, do some stuff <laughs> editing wise. Cool the office, all that good stuff. I'm gonna keep working on this. I'm we're going some more details. I apologize in advance. My kids have runs over, could get loud here. We're also supposed to get a storm before too long. So who knows? <laughs> who knows what could happen? Um, so anyway, here we are. Okay, and I'm gonna get in here and work on their faces. Um, I'm going to duplicate this as I do. And keep quoting the office. <laughs> Waiting to see if anybody's going to notice that every title is just office quotes. Only the real ones are going to know. So. I always forget to hit record. I don't actually know that it's necessary. And all these little like scratches, I'm gonna try not to glare at the screen either. That looked like she had a cleft chin. I don't think she did, so I think that might have just been a weird thing going on with the light. <clears throat> but I'm gonna take it off since I'm pretty confident she didn't. Just wanna smooth out all these like scratches and then we can really start sculpting her face. And it's interesting. Um, hey, LB. So this was the one that started all of this. And this was her, well, this is a really low res <laughs> copy of it. But this is the same woman at a different time. Oh, this is just gonna play two songs again. Let me quit that. Lose some calming cinematics. All right. So it's interesting to me. I did this other, so I was showing you her on that mega creative restoration, but I also had a couple of her daughters in that image and in this, I can really see how much they look like her. That was hard to tell before. And despite calming cinematics, I have Regulate stuck in my head. <laughs> I'm gonna take this brush a little bit bigger, but lower opacity. And then blend them. Hey, my day has been good, how are you? Glad to see everybody out on this Friday. Since I took out all this weird texture. So I'm working on, here's the original. I'm working on kind of, it's not technically a restoration because I'm taking some artistic liberties with it. But just kind of a fresh look at this old, <clears throat> I'm guessing this was probably um, around 1910. Oops, up close. And I got a little, I went ham here. 
So I'm gonna fix that. What's everybody up to tonight? I did not use Colorize Neutral. Is that in Photoshop? I don't even know what that is. I just, I've hand colored it so far. No, I didn't. I probably, it sounds like it would have been easier. <laughs> no, okay, all right, do I need to try it? Can I try it on just a layer? I'm gonna be mad if it would have saved me like three hours. Is it, you have to guide me. This is like a Ouija board. All right, filter. Do you see it on here? Filter gallery. Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, this is gonna. No. Okay, I'm gonna skip the tour because Blue Base is gonna be our tour guide. Do I down? I guess I download it. Or do I, are these individual things that I download? Okay, this is, I didn't know if there was gonna be a contest. <laughs> now it's me versus Photoshop filters. Uh-oh, okay, well that didn't work. <laughs> but it might be, it actually didn't do that bad of a job. I wanna do some of the other stuff. What is this? can't really tell. I feel like it did something. That looks pretty solid. I'm gonna play around with that. So, okay, let's see then what it did to his skin. Did I keep it? <laughs> That's pretty cool. So the color eyes didn't really, I feel better about myself. <laughs> but I'm interested in the skin thing. Let's do, let me grab one of these other ones and see what it would do on like a real, I've never, I've, <laughs> well, I'm not at all surprised by that. I didn't use the color eyes right? Now I'm distracted anyway, because I want to use the skin thing. What's their name? Here, let me grab this number. 7697. Okay. Zoom in. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Reset. 
There we go, now I can see it better. Harmonization. Hey, 47 islands. How is everybody tonight? I don't really see a difference here. Is it doing stuff? Or am I just getting impatient? Oh, I see it now. She has beautiful skin anyway. Oh, I don't hate that. Nothing ever good with freckles though okay that's fun but it's also very distracting yeah I can see it better on my uncalibrated monitor than I can um, on anything else okay anyway I'll get back here and just do it the old-fashioned way And it's, I want to add some depth too. Just finished a couple edits, so I was looking for some streamers to watch. Yay! You came to the right place. Thank you for stopping by. What did you stream tonight? Do you stream your edits or? Can you hear my um, children? It feels very loud. My neighbor had felt really loud today. Okay, gotcha. I've got some new filters to go <laughs> check out. I've never, I've literally never opened that up. So I'm learning things. Good with, good job with the website edits. Cause that is, I always feel like I just did, and then it was, you know, two or three years. In the very beginning, I would update it after every... I did my 100 followers giveaway last night, so I'll be eating ramen. I like ramen. Ramen gets a bad rap, but I like... I like the expensive ramen. Congratulations on your 100 followers. Ramen sounds really good right now. Okay, before I keep working on their faces, because I'm going to get bored with that, <laughs> I want to put some. Let me see if I can even see any. Did 
step in that flag. <laughs> could you maybe you could have um, if that happens again you could have a a printer local to them print it. That's pretty cool. Did they pick or did you pick what print? What did they pick? flower work. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to, since I darkened some of these blowouts really, before I need to do anything like that. Hi, baby. Okay. You look cool. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. <laughs> That's awesome. That's okay, Daddy took it down because it's going to storm. I'll be done in a minute. <laughs> okay. Just getting all my titles now from the office. I'm trying not to glare like glare at the <laughs> camera, but that's just my face. run out of things to talk about. Somebody give me a topic.
I'm drawing a blank. about to show you only took 30 seconds to do it's not perfect but it could be if I put real effort into it just a quick demo of color eyes okay I'm gonna drag this onto my screen then okay that's the beginning we're ready. Colorize with no tweaking. Okay, so it must work better with well lit and focus modern images. That's pretty cool. So it would probably be good with their skin and stuff. That would have been nice to know about when I was working on this. No, not this. This. This was my Gia nomination from this year. One of them. That these are all some ancestors and then the ancestral home that's not really... I mean, it's there. Somebody lives in it, but it's not what it used to be. So this was my way of preserving it. And then I've got my kids mixed in there too. But that's one of the, that just makes me so happy. It's one of the most important projects I've done so far. Not quite the most important, but one of them. That's pretty cool. I want to do some more of those. I have a client that is interested in having me do that with, she is um, of Japanese ancestry and um, they have kimonos or I don't know if it's one or if it's, if everybody has their own, but she was thinking of having some of their ancestors mixed in with her daughter. And I'm so hoping that that happens so if you're seeing this I'm so into that idea I'm still waiting I just watched three sisters on IG Yes, that is the story. So my oldest daughter passed and is watching over um, her baby sisters. So nailed it. <laughs> this doesn't feel like a natural. Um, got like 800 copies under here. I'm gonna save this. Yes, that is a real story. That's my, um, so I have six children. I have three boys and three girls and our oldest daughter passed. So last Monday was her birthday. And um, that was kind of just a little nod to her. The one with control point tweaks, is that a filter? Is that one of the filter things? Thank you. We were lucky to have had her at all. So she pops up a lot in my artwork. OK. 
Okay, so here's where we're at so far, and their faces are a mess, red hot mess. I have not really done much except colorize them. But, just wanted to, and the scenery is also from, so I grew up, my parents built their house on the same property as my grandparents. This is like 13 acres in between them. So I spent most of my childhood in the woods <laughs> in between those two houses. And my grandparents' house was also the house that this couple bought um, when they were married. So it was in our family for about a hundred years. And um, the scene back here is from my parents' house and my dad still lives there. Sent three images. The first was what I started with. Oh no, I didn't. Okay, here it is. <clears throat> oh yeah, very cool. Oh, and I can see over here. Did you tweak the black and white before? Let's see, all right, there's the black one. Okay, so yeah, that does have some tweaking. One, two, three. That's pretty cool. I like it. So anyway, I'm very into <laughs> like kind of tucking Easter eggs into all my images. Yeah, that's probably true. My mask is a little sticky tonight. Huh. I had to run that on one image in particular. My grandmother had red hair and that image was particularly hard to colorize. I like the process. I find it cathartic, so I kind of like to Okay, let me find one. So, okay. I'll show you the one that I'm gonna work on. So this was the big project. And then this is my grand, so this is my grandmother Marnie and my daughter Marnie. Now you know why they were next to each other. <laughs> and now I have to remember what I called that originally. Let's try it now. Oh, that is fun. All 
right, so then what do you tweak? Do you tweak over here? That is crazy. Oh man, I'm gonna go ham on this. Like not on this one in particular because I put a lot of time into the, I feel like the red hair was really the preview on the right, okay. Do. Just a... no, okay, undo. <laughs> it was better the first time. Oh, okay. So, ooh, I'm gonna struggle with that because I'm colored one. Do I pick the color first? Mm. Me winging it with color is a little dicey. did better. Take that away. <laughs> there we go. That is incredible. Okay, so I'm just going to do like, I'm just going to look at it like this. That is crazy. Oh, I'm too impatient. Hi, Ram Tide. How are you? Oh, that is okay. I'm going to do it one more time. I'm going to find another one. There is a cool one. Here they are. Let's do this one. I'm not going to get anything else done now. <laughs> I'm going to play with this. That's nuts. Okay, so... I just want to change like the jacket color. Mm. Did that do anything? Oh yeah, it did. Barely. I can hardly see that. Maybe you can. I know that hers was that kind of green color, but I'm not sure about his. I'm sure it wasn't blue. But their skin color looks good. Can you see me? Oh good, you can see me now. I was just, I was still talking. <laughs> okay, okay. I was just up here hanging out alone. <laughs> anyway, okay. Um, so this was in 1946 and they were both Marines. So this color feels kind of close. Her jacket color, but his is... Hello? <laughs> is anybody here? Yay! Okay, there's somebody there. You can see me? <laughs> I don't 
don't know what's going on, if it's my internet or if it's, um, yay, okay. We'll just get back to what I was doing. Maybe that's the universe is telling me <laughs> to just focus. Here we go. Thank you guys for hanging in. With the right color for there. Is that the Pinterest link? Okay, that looks the same that I'm seeing. <laughs> so this is when I rely on color pickers. <laughs> she, I know she had a green, but maybe it wasn't this one. Maybe it was actually, maybe that was it, because I know that was green. That one looks so pretty. I really like that one. Okay, I'm going to do one more. Okay, this is the women's. Oh, they were different colors. Okay, yeah, that one I can see is not close. Here. For those of you following along. So that's closer to his. All right. Let me see. I've got a couple more. I'm just gonna keep going. Oh, I've got another one after this. <laughs> okay, do all the work for me, Photoshop. Oh, that one's kind of anticlimactic after all. Still good though. I don't know who that guy is. So if he looks familiar, let me know. And I've got one more. We're gonna take it way back on this one. Oh, that's so cool. I mean, to get it there wouldn't take that long, but it's still really cool for instant gratification. No, I wonder if his jacket was blue. I don't know. Cool stuff though. Okay, let's try this one again. Take it from the top. The suspense was building. This is a tough one. I feel like it need to get cleaned up first anyway. Okay, I've got an idea. Started a whole lot of stuff in this <laughs> program right now that Yeah, that seems like that's what my, I was kind of thinking it would be pretty cool. I'm gonna smooth, you know what? Hmm. Let's just, let's experiment a little. I wonder if it'll skin smooth on like <laughs> a torn image. No, that just kind of. Is it doing anything? I can't tell. I'm too impatient. What does super zoom do? That's it. What was the one, uh, harmonization? Is that the one you thought would be good for composites? 
Okay, I've got an experiment here then. What was the name? Okay, that is not the most recent. <laughs> Let's do... I'm gonna crop this because we don't need guide images in here anyway. And then I'm gonna duplicate so that we can go back and forth really easily. It's getting really dark all of a sudden. This is a whole new world. And it also kind of sucks because I spent a lot of years learning to do this stuff by hand. Oh, we've temporarily disabled this filter because of an error. Hmm, that's weird. We'll do a different one then. Oh, okay. Changing attributes like time of day and season. Wow, okay. What do we want to do then? I'm not sure what I'm doing here. Oh, maybe I, do I just wait? <laughs> maybe I just should be patient. Ooh, the suspense is building. Makeup transfer, what? <laughs> I'm not sure what happened to her, <laughs> but that's crazy. Okay, <laughs> we'll just leave that one alone. Oh, okay. All right, so for that one, you need two completely different layers. Filter matches color and lighting between the layers. So you'd need one with the girl in the background. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, let's, we're not gonna save those changes. <laughs> We don't need Gramp either. Okay, my computer is being super weird right now. I gave it more than it could handle. Just calm down. Just relax. <laughs> and then I'm dying to go in there and smooth out those blown bits. But instead, I'm going to wait because... It's frozen. <laughs> this is chaos. And the kids have been uh, alarmingly quiet. I do like this one though. I'm gonna save this one. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna look at the, I don't know why it is doing the background like that, but that is irritating. Oh, okay.
All right, so I got some depth into that and I want to put some up in the flag as well. I don't even know what is on that layer. I think it is the dark shadow back there. The color transfer one could potentially help with uniforms. You could transfer the colors from Pinterest. Yes, that's what I was thinking. I could at very least like use the color picker from something that I know is the right. That's pretty cool. I'm probably gonna have to close this and I don't know what is going on it's it's chaos on twitch today let me check something real quick <laughs> okay all right so here is Photoshop have a good one. Thanks, LB. You know what? I'm going to, I wonder, oh, I, I bet I didn't save that though. So I'm going to have to write it out. If I didn't save, I obsessively save at all times and did not after that last one, because obviously my computer is spazzing out. So I cannot, I just have to wait now. Okay, give me your favorite office quotes <laughs> while we're waiting. I'm just going to keep titling my streams office quotes until somebody gives me a better idea. Why is it doing this? This is so frustrating. I wonder if it'll let me save it anyway and then I can just hmm. I'm just gonna save it anyway and then did it save nope sure didn't I guess I'm just gonna have to get over it and redo. We'll just do it like that. Okay, so I'm just gonna close it and I guess not save it. That's super frustrating. your fingers for me because <laughs> if there's not a shadow behind his head I don't know when the last time I saved was and I'm gonna get real frustrated mm! okay so there's that one man all right okay but it's working now so I'll just get over it make my shadow so we got there and then probably have to do something with his weirdly shaped neck <laughs> but I will not complain because it's hanging in there I ask a lot of my computer
back up. And I know I've got to work on their faces so they look less like creepy ghosts. And more just like people hanging out with the flag, as you do. There we go. All right, I'm gonna merge those, duplicate, and I'm gonna save before we go sideways again. Okay, I wondered, since it wasn't giving me percentages, I figured it probably wasn't working. All right, he looks particularly, you know what, I'm gonna work on her first because that'll be more satisfying to see one like relatively close to, fru to fruition. So I'm going to burn rather than use any color right now because I'll have to get in there with color anyway. And this is where you got to be careful. She had brown eyes, so it was hard to, it's hard to. No, that's too much. Settle down there. I usually don't have my burn exposure over 9%, maybe 12. I'm really feeling frisky. And um, I've got it really high just because I'm using it to sculpt right now. And as you can see, it's slow going. But that's okay. I'm going to put a little bit of color, that's way too big, right here. And I'm going to take that, even though there's a hard shadow there, I want it to have some depth and not be Too much. And then at some point we'll have to get in there with white, but that is always <laughs> dicey because with white it's going to be so stark. See? <laughs> so I'll go really, really light there. start to shape the teeth a little bit and then we can do some highlights they're shaded they're real shaded working on some highlights. I want her eyes to match. So now I laid out some color there. I'm going to start
Just trying to get rid of, this is still some of that. Um, kind of leftover information from what was on the image or dust or you know who knows it was such a it's such an old image I'm gonna go bigger so I can do some kind of sweeping color I'm just laying the color out like I would a painting. And then I can go back in. If I were painting with oils, I would go in with my finger and kind of smudge and smear. So what you're seeing here is very, very, very similar process to what I do when I am creating um, an image with oils. Just kind of smearing those pixels until they make sense. And then we definitely need some So when you're lighting um, a portrait subject and you have your main light and your kicker, or you have your main light and your ambient light, if it's a strong ambient direction, if you have them too close to the front, you'll get like a line of um, where they're intersecting. And um, that is created a lot in nature just because you know just that's, that's how our eyes work that's how light works <laughs> so i'm creating that in this whereas in a if i were photographing someone i would be working to not create that but because it's a natural part of the way light works and they you know had other stuff on their minds in around 1910. Um, so that's part of just understanding the light that you're seeing. So I'm going to go back to burn and I'm going to go a little smaller. I'm trying to get the fold of the eyelid and the eyes. Okay, 
so all right we'll just keep working there's a party going on downstairs <laughs> If I had to guess, I would guess laser tag. set so that we can start putting the details in there that really not right now can we eat something we're hungry actually just just a minute okay I'll be in in just a minute, okay? Okay. Okay, just adding some of this texture in. trying to smooth out some of this and have more of a painterly texture than actual brush strokes but I do want to add a little bit right a little dark in there like a cat's looking face. <laughs> and then So, okay, and we've got to change the shape of her nose a little bit because we're going a little sideways there. But it's starting to come together. I'm gonna save it because again, it's not really responding well to, it does do this, oh, it's still saving. All right, I'll give it a minute. <laughs> Before I go anywhere, I do see another little shadow shadow that I want to
merge those and save again, which stinks because I just did. got a change in her face. <laughs> her nose especially. I think what I'll do is just do a little bit Bit of shading, put some color in there that I can really, um, yeah, so that's where we're losing it right there. other side. Actually, I think I'm going to go with a burn tool here instead. There we go. All right. We're getting there. So the original, and that's our progress so far. Definitely a long way to go, but it's okay. Her face, has, her shape has changed of her face a little bit, so that we'll have to address that. I'm going to go bigger. And just give her a nice hard shadow here. So that's where we started the day and that's where we'll end for now um, a long road ahead of us <laughs> yeah that nose is it sounds like the there that just made a solid difference Okay, so what I do want to do is push this up a little bit. I 
then I keep thinking I'll be done. And then finding other stuff to do. I want to see some gradual changes. That's too much. <laughs> we'll quit that. just trying to mimic those shadows to keep to maintain the real basic shape of her face and that is easier said than done because what you see doesn't necessarily mimic what makes sense especially on these older images that don't give a ton of information whoops wrong one to go up. Quick, I'm going to saved thank you guys so much for being here tonight and for um, sticking it out with me um, you know with my internet issues <laughs> so thank you guys so much if you haven't followed along I would love to have you follow along on here on YouTube on Instagram thank you so much have an awesome Friday the Guadu, my mommy. <laughs> <laughs>